Well, the time and temperature number has provided the Helena area with up-to-date information since the 1950s. It still sees thousands of calls each month, but recently the free service almost went away until a new owner stepped in. Daniel Lodi dials the number, the same number it's been since 1956, 406-442-1730. Moments later, as the phone rings, a light flashes on this box on the other side of Daniel's office. That box answers Dan's call, and then... From the U.S. Naval Observatory's master clock, the time is 10.01, current temperature 77 degrees. That's how the time and temperature phone line, a vestige of days gone by, has operated for decades. And that's how it will continue to operate since Daniel recently took over the responsibility of keeping the line active. I've always wanted to take run, run a time and temperature number, so this has really worked out. An expert in telephony by hobby and profession, Daniel says it was important to him to keep the number going. If you're wondering, do people really still call the time and temperature number when that information is just a swipe away? Well, the answer is yes. The number sees up to 5,000 calls each month. Just this January, that number hit a record of 19,000 calls. Daniel isn't exactly sure why, but has some ideas. If you're, if you're laying in bed or you're not near a clock and you don't really want to get up or go and try and find the time or figure out what temperature it is, you could just pick up the phone and call time of day service. The GPS sensor plugs in here and then the temp sensor plugs in there. The system itself is relatively low maintenance and Daniel plans to continue operating it for as long as he can. Could you uh, encourage people who maybe never thought about giving it a call to give it a call? Oh yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Right now the machine is in Daniel's office in Butte. His goal is to get the machine back to Helena where it can start recording Helena temperatures.